I'm meteorologist Todd Claussen. Thanks for joining us on HTSN. With the exception of Sunday, this has been a very cold and active weather pattern across central Indiana. We've seen snow showers yesterday, and we saw temperatures that were well below normal. Our high got up to 31 degrees yesterday, a full 20 degrees below the normal high of 51 degrees. Did get up to 33 in Lafayette, as well as Terre Haute. 31 was the high temperature in Muncie. Now, throughout the course of the day, today, the temperature is still going to be below normal, a little better than yesterday. We'll get up to 39 degrees for our high temperature with some isolated showers making their way into central Indiana this afternoon and they'll mix with some snow showers as well as the temperatures start to fall throughout the evening hours but the good news is I don't think we'll see any accumulation at least on the roadways causing any issue there could be a coating on some grassy surfaces and that'll be just about it the best bet of any coating would be north of Indianapolis and as we go into the evening hours just a few flurries left by eight o'clock and a temperature right around 32 degrees I'll take you through the day today using TrueCast and show you the temperatures. Highs only in the upper 30s to the north, about 39 in Peru as well as Muncie. Our high will be right around 40 degrees again here in Indianapolis, and about 42 in Bloomington. And then overnight tonight, we'll drop down into the 30s, so it's not as cold tomorrow morning as you wake up as it was this morning when the temperatures dipped down into the 20s. And then as we go throughout the day tomorrow, we'll see the high temperature climb up to about 53 degrees here in Indianapolis. But notice we are a state divided. To the north, temperatures remain very chilly, a high of only 43 degrees degrees in Peru, about 47 in Muncie. As you go south, though, Bloomington will approach 60 degrees for the high temperature. And how about Evansville at 66 for the high? So some warmer air does work in. Of course, the parade going on in downtown Indianapolis for St. Patrick's Day tomorrow. Should be just fine with that with partly cloudy skies and temperatures in the 40s, eventually warming again up into the 50s. So throughout the day today, the clouds will quickly increase. Again, this is not a big storm system heading our way. In fact, TrueCast not picking up much in the way of precipitation. But again, I do think there'll be some rain and snow showers across the area, but everything will be very, very light. Also taking place tonight, the greening of the canal if you're heading downtown for that. It'll be chilly temperatures in the upper 30s. Again, there could be a very light wintry mix. And as we talked about, it's warmer for the same. Patrick's Day parade tomorrow and also dry and then looking ahead to the rest of St. Patrick's Day weekend. Saturday some morning sprinkles and mostly cloudy more of a chance of rain and snow showers on Sunday with a high of 41 degrees and then decent rainfall looks like it's in place across the area on Monday with a high of 50 degrees.